everyone, so if you've been following me on Instagram, you probably picked up that I just went to the D23 Expo and it was one of the highlights of my life. I absolutely loved it. So I thought I'd do a haul for you guys and show you all the stuff that I got. Okay, so as soon as I entered the expo, I got three things. The first thing was a lanyard, which we put our badge on for the day. Very cool, very cool. The second one was a guidebook, which covered all the things you can do at the D23 Expo. So it's got a schedule, it's got a map, all the important details that you need to succeed. And the third thing I got was this tote bag, which says D23 Expo on one side, and on the other side it has Disney Plus, which I'm definitely getting Disney Plus. <laughs> The first place I went to when I entered the D23 Expo was the Disney Store because I had one item I really, really wanted to get and that was the Giselle doll. So we got Giselle and we've got Edward. I love Enchanted so much. It's one of my favorite movies and there's hardly any merchandise for the movie. So I was so excited when I found out they were making a Giselle doll and I woke up at 4 a.m. and waited there since about 5 a.m. till the expo opened and then another two hours at the Disney store and it was worth it because it's so pretty. <gasps> so nice. I also got three other items at the Disney store. I'll just get them. The other item was Simba with Rafiki. So Rafiki's holding up Simba like at the beginning of Circle of Life. I just think it's so cool. And I think there's only about 300 of these. So I had to get it. It was so cute. Um, the other thing I got was a Donald Duck for his 85th anniversary. So he came in this can, which is like an orange juice can. And it has like the ingredients that he's a temperamental prankster and all that kind of fun stuff. And inside was Donald! He's so cute! Look at him! And he also smells like oranges and it's a really, really strong orange smell. Oh, he smells so good. I love him so much. And the last thing that I got at the Disney store was, I'll just grab it for you, a Meg mug. Now they're releasing a Meg doll later on this year, but they're releasing some of their merchandise associated with the dolls at the expo. And this is a Meg mug. So you got beautiful Meg. I love Meg so much. And then on the back it says, I won't say I'm in love from her song. So I thought that was really, really, really cute. Oh, and I also got a key. Just trying to find the key. Wherever it is. No, it's not here. <laughs> oh, there it is. Got it. Got it. I also got a key, which you could buy with any purchase. So it's got a little castle in the lock. It's very cool. I like it a lot. I think it's good. The next place I shopped at was the Dream Store. Now I got two items at the Dream Store. The first one was a standard D23 Expo pin. Because obviously you need to have a pin for every single Disney event that you go to. And the other thing I got was a spirit jersey. This is my second spirit jersey. I think they're great. Super comfy. So you see it's got the Mickey logo at the front, D23 Expo, and on the back, it looks very cool. They've got, ah, here we are, D23 Expo, and it's a pretty rainbow thing. It's so nice. I'm going to wear this all the time and have people ask me about the D23 Expo, so I have an excuse to talk about it. I also had another thing that I really, really wanted from the Dream Store, and that was the Mickey Kitchen Sink Sunday pin. I wanted it so desperately, but it was released Saturday morning, and I was at the panel that morning, so it was sold out by the time I got there after the panel. So I've ended up ordering it on eBay for a very very high price but it was the the other thing i wanted it, it was the kitchen sink pink and the giselle doll so i was like it was one of the two things i wanted so i just paid it didn't like it but i'm gonna have it soon so <laughs> that's a good thing the third store that i went to was mickey's of glendale's i got a lot of stuff there the first thing i got was this epcot shirt that i'm wearing right now which features its new logo for when it gets its renovations. The other thing I got was this notepad. I actually bought this for mum because she loves lime green. So it's got the sorcerer hat and it's got a green notepad. I thought that was really nice. I also got this rainbow one for me, which is a similar kind of thing, except it's a little bit smaller and it's just got rainbow down the edge. That's really cute. I also got this paintbrush pen for mum. So it looks like a paintbrush but it's actually a pen. See? It's really cool. 
And I also got a pin for myself. They had all the different Epcot new logo pins and I picked the one that was Imagination. So I used to work at Imagination so this is a lot of sentimental value for me and I'm really really glad they're not destroying Figment and if you do I will come for you Disney. Don't destroy it please, I love Figment. And the final thing I got was a present for one of my friends. It is a Fox and a Hound pin. Best in show for the Mickeys of Glendale pin store, which is a crazy place, by the way. Absolutely insane. I can't believe people waited all day. But I got this pin, and I love it. And my friend's going to love it too, so I'm excited to give it to her today. I was lucky enough to get a reservation to get some amazing freebies. Now, the first freebie that I got was Pixar sunglasses. Look how cool they look. I'm so cool. And it has a Pixar ball on one side, and the word Pixar on the other side. I also got a Pixar ball, which is so cute. Love it. And I got a set of four Frozen prints. So we've got Anna, the best princess in the world, Olaf, Kristoff and Sven, and Elsa. So I might put them in some sort of configuration and frame those. And the last thing that I got, which is my favorite thing, is this Frozen 2 poster. It's so good. I'm going to frame it. I'm seriously so excited for Frozen 2, you guys. I'm going to do a recap on all the things they shared with us at the panel, which I'll create a video for that later. So watch that video and I'll tell you all the amazing things that Frozen 2 is going to be. I'm just, I'm so pumped. And this poster is so great. I was also lucky enough to get stage pass reservations for the Walt Disney Studios panel and the Walt Disney Parks panel, which... They were so amazing. The studio's panel was possibly the highlight of my life. And they gave us three posters at that panel. Again, we have the amazing Frozen posters, so I have two of them. I got an Onward poster, which looks like this. I'm actually really excited about Onward after seeing the little clips they played for us, by the way. It's going to be a really funny movie. And we have... Star Wars poster, which I'm actually selling on eBay. It's auctioning off in about a day, so you should definitely bid on it. Because I'm not a massive Star Wars fan, so I thought I'd give it to somebody who is a massive Star Wars fan. The second panel was the Parks panel, and I got three things there. We got it in this little bag. So first things first, we got a Target gift voucher because Target and the Disney store are combining. So some Targets will have Disney stores now. So we've got the $10 gift card. One of the gift cards had like $2,300, but it is not my gift card, sadly. The other thing I got was an Avengers Campus pin because they're doing an Avengers themed land in LA. So there's that pin. And I also got a bullseye little badge thing. It says August 25th, 2019, at D23 Expo, which I... One place that I went to on the show floor was the D23 Gold Member Lounge. I wasn't expecting this to be so good, but they gave away a lot of freebies. On our first day, we, like, spun a wheel and we got an ice cream. But on the second day, we spun the wheel and we got this bag. It's really cool. I like it. Completely free as well. And we also got given, while we were sitting at the lounge enjoying our ice cream and drinks, two things. On the first day, we got a um, pop socket, gold member pop socket. And on the second day, I honestly could not believe my luck. I got an Imagination Epcot patch. I know. Of all the places, I got the Imagination one. I was really impressed with the gold member lounge. I didn't think it would be any good, but we got a whole bunch of free stuff and we got to sit down, which we definitely needed. I also got a whole bunch of miscellaneous items that I got from the show floor. First up, I got a pin, an aerial pin from what I was cosplaying that day from the Disney Studio store. Very, very cute. I got a sunglass case with the Mickeys. Very appropriate. And I got an American Tourista lock with Mickey. One of my most prized possessions is this Sleeping Beauty makeup set. It is so, so adorable. I can't even. It's the book from the beginning of the movie. Oh! Okay, so it's actually an eyeshadow palette. So you open it up, and there's Sleeping Beauty. There's Maleficent. And there is the eyeshadow. I haven't used it yet, but I'm definitely going to start using it. And I also got two lipsticks. One was free and one was not free. I will show you the one that was not free first. So it is 
this one. It was called the Make a Pink, Make a Blue, which is one of my favorite moments in Sleeping Beauty. And it is a blue lipstick, but when you put it on, it turns pink. So I'm just going to put it on my hand so I don't look crazy with blue makeup. So there we are. It's blue right now, but it's going to gradually change to pink. Any day now. I'll show you the other one while it, while it changes. So I got this as a free B for being a gold member. This is a Mermaid Lagoon lipstick. So it's like some sort of pearl color. Very cute. Very cute. Let's see if my hand is pink yet. It's still blue. But I assure you, it turns pink. I'll show you at the end of the video. I got so much free stuff just by walking through different parts of the show floor. It'd take me all day to show you them all. So I'll just show you my favorites. Now, my absolute favorite was the first ever Frozen 2 pin. I got this from doing the photo op with the Frozen characters. It was very cute. And the other thing that I really liked was the Disney Team of Heroes giveaway. So they gave you a pin which was sourced from Mickey on the first day and they also had a Marvel and a Star Wars on the other two days and they also gave you a bag which I love this bag it's got Ariel it's got Moana it's got Aladdin oh it's adorable I love it so much freebies are great I love all things free another thing I got for free was the d23 gold member gift which is a poster so it's got Mickey and it's got a whole bunch of Disney characters over there and it was free which is always good so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed looking at all the stuff I bought. I bought a lot of stuff, but I got a lot of stuff for free as well, which is very good. Oh, and also, this is pink now. Well, pinky blue, but it's getting there. It's getting towards pink. It's all good. So I will be uploading all of my D23 vlogs this week. So subscribe to this channel and like this video for more Disney-related content. Bye!